Stanford University. This is a phenomenon called flutter, threatening to shake the wings off a glider. Uncontrolled, it is extremely dangerous. They happen in many, many mechanical systems, and they're always the result of some interaction between a fluid and a structure, and that leads to these undesirable phenomena. Farhat and engineering research associate David Amselin have been studying the problem for five years, developing ways to prevent it. Their focus has been on high-speed aircraft. So the name of the game is fast prediction of these phenomena so that you can also have a very fast prevention of them. That means giving the pilot information developed on a computer in seconds to keep the plane from going out of control. Using mathematical models to predict flutter has been done using a supercomputer, but it doesn't fit in a cockpit. So scientists made it smaller. In real time, predict what your stability is. We can apply mathematical techniques that would shrink the size of that computational model from millions of unknowns to a couple dozen of unknowns and we shrink this model to such a small size that now it can fit on the smallest chip that you can imagine, such as the chip that sits inside a smartphone. The research to combat flutter is attracting a lot of attention and has potentially wide applications. Toyota is interested in it, both for their race cars and their street cars. Boeing, the Navy, we are very excited about this. And this is the best way I can see that we in engineering can contribute to our society. For more, please visit us at stanford.edu.